Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armour with the Stock Swoosh, and I'm reviewing HRB. This was the play of the day today in the Stock Swoosh Show live trading room. This was the top pick I had this morning. It rated 23 points, and this was the best gap. I said this is the best gap. I ended up doing just a quick, quick 15-minute setup in this. I really, honestly, in the morning, I didn't even put down, well, no, I did put down. I think I did put down $27 as a dream target. I think I did put that down, but... Honestly, with the market being so bullish today, I really didn't have 100% conviction it would get to the dream target, but it did. And it actually looks like it's gonna break a new low in here now. You could still be in this. Before I closed out the room, I said, this is an afternoon setup if you wanna do it. Here, I'll show you. I did one, it's actually already set up a second time. You could be in this again. This actually looks like it might break 27 and go to 26 something, 26.50, 26.25. Anyways, I did a quick, quick, quick just short in here just to see if it would break the low it didn't and i got out but it was a nice tight entry this is like a little doji entry on the 15 minute you hardly ever get these but the stock was so weak the gap rated 23 points you know it's it's basically this is like a perfect gap for anything to be 23 24 25 26 is amazing and it's still earning season so we get gaps like this so here was my entry in this in the afternoon 11 15 reversal time boom boom and it really should have broke the low in here by noon. It didn't, so then I just took it. But looks like this is going to break again. So the second entry, if you wanted to do a second afternoon play here, was here. And you're really doing this if you do it because you think it's going to break the low. There'd be no reason to do this for 26 cents. You're doing it because you think it's going to drop a dollar. But again, you do not have the market with you in the afternoon. I don't think you need it for this gap, though. I mean, this is an amazing gap. So let's take a look at it. One of the reasons that I like this gap so much was because of the fact that it is a corrective gap, meaning that this chart now, after today, is now in a downtrend, and it wasn't an uptrend. So this is actually a, a core, short, overnight swing trade. This is, a, this is, I mean, this is why I said this is an amazing gap today. So when a stock goes from being an uptrend to a downtrend, it's called a corrective gap, and that's exactly what this did today. The immediate entry out of the gate, though, show you. Look at this. No one in the world is buying this stock today. Look at that. The immediate entry out of the gate, though, was here. It did break, but you had to exit some of this here in the morning very quickly. It dropped hard 50 cents. And it did break 29. I mean, it did break 29. The normal target on the day for this was 28. It really flipped high though over the high of the day the good thing about it was though that it did hold 30 okay and then in the room i called like a kamikaze in here i think it was on the it's on the two minute chart let me find it i called a kamikaze in the room it was a late late morning train that that ended up working out here it was i called this kamikaze in the room it was 24 by 2905 i said and it worked this kamikaze call dropped a dollar and some people in the room did it. And I call it a kamikaze because it's a late second entry, but it worked. Anyways, either way, this is a beautiful short. It was a great sell-off today. It had nothing to do with the market. It's, you know, lower in the overall bigger picture and was a nice trade today for everybody that did it in the trading room. Have a great day, everyone. Email me at melissathestockswish.com if you would like more information or if you want to sign up for the Golden Gap class. That is Saturday, March 5th. That's tomorrow. And Monday, March 7th. Today is the last day to sign up. Have a great day, everybody.